Well, hello everyone, Dylan here with another LEGO Star Wars review, and this one is on the Dark Trooper attack set that is now being released, or just got released, of course. <coughs> so on the front of the box here, we have the LEGO and Star Wars logos, picture of the set that there is, and the four remaining things included, and that same border, or similar-ish border that we've been seeing since the beginning of the year, and then of course, now with the odd orange strip and the Mandalorian and Grogu there, uh, depicting that it's a Mandalorian set, obviously. Anyway. And then a track recommendation is 8 and up, set number 75324, has 166 pieces. And as we flip to the back, we which have a kind of similar picture of it and all the features of it, logos again. And, uh, and now onto the instruction manual. Same picture as on the front of the box and everything. On the back, kind of went on the online survey. All the pieces that come with the set. And then large out of some Mandalorian sets from last couple of years along with this one. And also add for some set for sets in this current wave and also as this uh, again, so it's in two different advertisements. Kind of interesting how they did, but yeah. And then last building steps. So first off, for the mini figures, we which have of course Jedi Knight version Luke Skywalker, of which. And of course, torso print and leg print, all new and a little different for that. Face print done quite goodly, and of course, and he of course wielding the green lightsaber as suiting to both episode 6 and, and of course this show, of course. And also does have the newer style uh, hood piece that recent Obi-Wan Kenobi had, well, since that we've seen since like 2019 with Obi-Wan and of course won the Knights of Ren of course. But of course good to see here with Luke obviously. But yeah. And the other three of which are three of Dark Troopers. Which only way when of course the only way to get them was in the uh, 160 or 80 dollar uh, Imperial Light Cruiser set last year or so. At least good to have in it a good cheap set like this right here. So if you weren't able to obtain the light cruiser, well, this is which is a good way to do so. And of course, this set good for army building these, of course. And of course, if you're not familiar, is of course headpiece new and now also a helmet set, obviously, and also everything the same as that, of course. And what's kind of new to these are the. Uh, alien Conquest blasters with binoculars on them to make them long rifles, of course. But kind of interesting. Good to see that continue, but yeah. And of course, Luke Skywalker. And also has double side face. And it, each Dark Trooper does have some similar, the same back head print, of course. And a back torso print done quite nicely. And the cape of which is in a softer cloth material, of which good to see used there. So of course, the three troopers of which, which making good for army building, obviously, and yeah. And on to the main build of the set, this. Which, as you can see, it's kind of been like a little section of the Imperial Light Cruiser set, which, well, from this view, uh, which is big, all you get, and it does work out as a di nice diorama, of course, but flip to the other side, not much of anything, I mean, quite barren, you can see, and also a little hollow space underneath there. Since, of course, this view of which is all your, what you are to see, if you are to put it on the shelf or desktop or whatever. And if you notice in the build is, of course, this large open space to obviously for a mean fig to walk through, obviously. Although you can, like, kind of modify it with 
like special plates make it and give an optical illusion effect like in the large Death Star set. And so now for some bits of that. Like this one side of which does have a reversed snot technique where these little studs here are put other side of which and or shown this way with represent buttons of course and also do you have well there's a lot of stickers in this set like in here and also on the wall of course but also of course this little section here is where uh, Luke would, would stand on to of course and of course you can like oh whoops rotate around unless you, you put them on the farther back studs of course Anyways, and of course, rotate in and have them um, emerge like that. Oh, which good fun feature like we've seen with the uh, 2018 Throne Room Dual set, of course. Well, but if you are to put Luke in this part, make sure he's not holding the lightsaber because it gets in the way. And well, aside from that, even if you notice this little these this rounded plate area here is where you can also put Luke onto and swish back and forth to make it look give him the swishing effect. And also what one of those jumpers there are for is right there for is uh, hang on is where you can place a dark trooper in and also with this thing pull back to make represent him getting pushed away by the force which such a nice good feature obviously and as for the back part as the back parts of which these are which all stickers but they look well look good for that and also good use of the ridge brick pieces to add in some bit of like extra greebling and also above these white grilled pieces acting as like vents and all and also good use of button stick good use sticker representing the buttons there obviously and yeah and uh, what else not much but yeah and also of course uh, quite good large amount of studs enough to fit your other two dark troopers into a course and it, to, to work on like a good make works out as a good display scene and also if you have Mandal have the Mandalorian slash Dinjarin and Kara Dune and Grogu uh, mini figs can also and also Grief Kark of mini figs can place as much as you want on there obviously but yeah and it kind of works out as a good uh, display build diorama yeah And so now, on to my final verdict. So overall, I think this is which a quite a good smallish set. Like, of course, like the three Dark Troopers, great to have for army building. And also good, a new version of Luke Skywalker, of course. And also, and as for the build of which, which does have a couple good features, but Although it does kind of work out as a good display piece, but although this does open the possibility for some other small diorama sets of Star Wars, well, if not just Star Wars, but plenty of other themes in general. Like for Star Wars, like probably a Death Star duel with Vader and Obi Wan, or a Geonosis and whatnot. But yeah. And I guess also. Some parts of Star Killer Base, but yeah. But also the uh, size for, or price for pizza, which which kind of a bit on the smallish side, but at least it's because you know Star Wars rights and everything. But yeah. And also, and aside from using the main build of which, but you can also but at least it does provide as a good parts pack, which most parts in here you can definitely use for. Some like a uh, special uh, for any Star Wars builds or whatever, and of course, at the same time, army build your dark troopers, obviously, of course. But yeah, 
And so now if you're looking to get this set for your Mandalorian set collection, definitely pick this up. And if you're looking to uh, get a few extra uh, Dark Troopers, and also definitely pick this up. And that is it with this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.